get ready for the dictation start this appeal raises significant issues of public importance engaging as it does the interface between citizens and their businesses with the fiscal administration legislation enacted for the levy of goods and services tax confers a power on the taxation authorities to impose a provisional attachment on the properties of the SSE including bank accounts the legislation in himachal pradesh which comes up for interpretation in the present case has conferred the power on the commissioner to order provisional attachment of the property of the SSE subject to the formation of an opinion that such attachment is necessary in the interest of protecting the government revenue what specifically is the ambit of this power what are the safeguards available to the citizen in interpreting the law the court has to chart a course which will ensure a fair exercise of statutory powers the legitimate concerns of citizens over arbitrary exercises of power have to be protected while ensuring that the legislative purpose in entrusting the authority to order a provisional attachment is fulfilled the rule of law in a constitutional framework is fulfilled when law is substantively fair procedurally fair and applied in a fair manner each of these three components will need to be addressed in the course of interpreting the tax statute in the present case this appeal arises from a judgment and order dated 1 january 2021 of a division bench of the high court of himachal pradesh the high court dismissed the writ petition instituted under article 226 of the constitution challenging orders of provisional attachment on the ground that an alternate remedy is available the appellant challenged the orders issued on 28 october 2020 by the joint commissioner of state taxes and excise para number 1 provisionally attaching the appellant's receivables from its customers the provisional attachment was ordered while invoking section 83 of the himachal pradesh goods and service tax act 2017 and rule 159 of himachal pradesh goods and service tax rules 2017 while dismissing the writ petition on grounds of maintainability the high court was of the view that the appellant had an alternative and efficacious remedy of an appeal under section 107 of the hp gst act at issue in this case is whether the orders of provisional attachment issued by the third respondent against the appellant on 28 october 2020 are in consonance with the conditions stipulated in section 83 of the hp gst act the answer to this will require the court to embark on an interpretative journey of unraveling the substantive and procedural content of the power the preliminary issue is whether the high court was right in concluding that the provisional attachment could not be challenged in a petition under article 226 the facts in the context of which this case arises are thus the appellant manufactures lead according to the specific requirements of its clients and has a factory at village mirpur gurudwara in the district of sirmor of himachal pradesh the appellant has been in the same line of business since 2008 stop